Listen, you are not losing your mind. Neither are you going insane. But what's happening is God is imparting in you a new spiritual gift. Let me explain. Welcome to the Get Right With God podcast with Jamar Grimsley, where we're all a work in progress. Nobody has their life all the way together. We're all trying to get right with God. You are not going out of your mind. God has given you the gift of wisdom. Oh, let me say that again. I said you are not going out of your mind, but God has given you the gift of wisdom. So what am I talking about, you guys? God is about to give someone the gift of wisdom and knowledge, right? And so when God gives you this gift, right? It's going to be a type of gift that you're going to know things, right? You're going to know things that you don't even know how you're going to know these things. But the knowledge that you're going to be given, it's like a gift of teaching that God has given you, right? But the knowledge that you're going to get is going to be straight from heaven, right? But everything you teach, everything you say is going to be true. It's going to be true. Like It's like you're speaking the truth, which is from the spirit of God, but it's as if you went to school to learn these things or, or or something, but it's just like a supernatural divine gift that is going to be a blessing to the kingdom. It's going to be a blessing even to your own life, right? It's going to help so many people, child of God, right? So I have a scripture here, um, but the way you're going to operate in this gift is going to be in such a powerful way, right? It's going to be in such a powerful way. And this type of gift, it's like no, it's not, it's like a rare gift. It's like a rare gift, but you have been chosen to teach like you've been chosen to teach. So God is imparting in you the spirit of wisdom, the spirit of wisdom. Right. So this is Mark chapter six. I'm just going to read a few verses, you guys. Right. It says, and he went out from thence and came into his own country. This is Jesus. They talking about and his disciples. They followed him. Right. It says, and when the Sabbath day was come. He began to teach in the synagogue, right? It says, and many hearing him were astonished. They said, from which hath this man, where does he know these things? And what wisdom is this, which is given unto him, that even such mighty works are wrought by his hands, right? So, When you begin to operate in this gift, child of God, people are going to look at you and they're not going to understand how you know what it is that you know that you know. But it's because God has given you the gift of wisdom. Right. And now let me explain it to you how how let me let me let me go a little further. This is verse three. It says, is not this the carpenter's son? Right. The son of Mary, the brother of James and Joseph. Right. And of Judah and Simon. Right. And are not his sisters here with us? And they were offended at him. So they're looking at Jesus as like, okay, this is just a carpenter's son. Isn't this, you know, Mary's son? Isn't this the same person? How did he know this? Like, this is the person we know. Like, we know this person. So this can't be him because he doesn't supposed to know these things. We don't understand how he knows these things, right? We don't understand how. He knows these things. Right. But it's a supernatural gift. And people are going to be amazed that when you begin to operate in this gift, child of God and the way God showed me that it works. Right. It's like a separation. Right. And that's why I say you are not losing your mind, because sometimes you're going to feel like you are going out of your mind completely. Anybody ever was like screaming out to God and crying out and you didn't know what was happening and you crying out, Lord, what's going on with me? Right. The way God showed it to me, it's like there's a separation which is happening. Right. So this part of you is separating from this part of you. This is like the worldly part right here. Right. So this part has to separate from this part. And once this part separates, it goes on its own separated. And this part, it dies out. Right. So now you're going to be walking in this gift, child of God. And it's a very powerful gift. It's a very powerful gift. And, you know, um, again, don't 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 let pride kick in when God begins to give you this gift and you begin to operate in this thing. Right. But it's a very powerful gift. And that is why you're feeling like 
you know, like you losing your mind almost and you crying out to God, what's wrong with me? Why is my emotions all over the place? And why can't I get it together? It's because God is giving you this gift and this is happening in the realm of the spirit. And that's why you're feeling like that. This is not for everybody. But if you are feeling like that, this is what's happening for you, right? God is imparting in you the spirit of wisdom, right? There's a separation happening, child of God, right? So it's a beautiful thing. You about to operate in supernatural gifts like never before, right? You're going to have people shocked. You're going to have people shocked. So I could just say congratulations, 